Hi guys, this is a lovely video where we're going to solve fractional exponents and negative exponents. Here, what you see in your exponent, there's a fraction, right? That's called as fractional exponent. Now, here in this question, you have 16 over 25. Now, fractional exponent, whenever you have a fraction, so the top part, the numerator is always the power. You just have to remember this that's the power and the denominator the bottom part is always the root so here you have square root and the power is 1 so we do we can just write it like this if you have something like this a to the power of m over n so you can convert this is the power this is the root so you can write it as nth root of a and then you can apply the power that's your power m so this is how we're going to convert it into so we have 16 over 25 here and what's the root we're going to apply that square root and the power is just one now that's equal to square you can just split the square root that's square root of 16 over square root of 25 power is one Square root of 16 is 4, square root of 25 is 5, and that's your answer. All right, let's move on to the next one. We have 32 to the power of negative 0 0.4. Now here you have a negative exponent. So for negative exponent, if at all you have something like this, a to the power of negative m. So you just take the reciprocal of that, a, and the power becomes positive. So you'll have 1 over a to the power of m. So we're going to convert it like that. Now as I have a negative exponent here, I'm going to first take the reciprocal of that. So 1 over 32. So as we have 0 0.4 here, 0 0.4 here. So that's actually a fraction. You can write it as 4 tenths. So I'm going to write this as 4 over 10. Now you can cancel this out. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 5 is 10. So you have again a fractional exponent which is 1 over 32 to the power of 2 fifths. So this is your power and this is your root. Now let's just convert it back. 1 over your root is fifth root of 32 over you have the power of 2 power of 2 now how can you find what's fifth root of 32 just take the LCM of 32 that's 2 times 16 then 2 times 8 2 times 4 2 times 2 and then you have 2 times 1 so how many twos do you have five twos isn't it so you can write it as so therefore fifth root of 32 is Two, right so you have 1 over 2 and the power is 2 2 squared so 1 over 2 squared is 1 over 4 and that's your answer all right let's move on to next example here you have 25 to the power of half divided by 2 to the power of negative 2 so you have fractional exponent plus a negative exponent so how are we going to do that so here we have 25 let's convert it back this is the power this is the root so we have square root of 25 to the power of 1 divided by you have a negative exponent so take the reciprocal so you have 2 squared which is equal to square root of 25 is 5 divided by 1 over 2 square is 4 now you have the division of fractions this is a whole number so whatever is your bottom is always 1 so let's uh, do it using our KFC rule that's the keep flip and change so keep the first fraction that's 5 over 1 flip the second fraction that's 4 over 1 change the signs to multiplication now just multiply the fractions 4 5 times 4 is 20 1 times 1 is 1 that's 20 that's your answer all right let's move on to another question that's 16 to the power of 1.5 plus 8 to the power of 0 now here you have 1.5 as i told you the decimal numbers can be written in the form of fractions this is in the ones place 
this is in the tens place on the left hand side of the decimal the numbers are multiplied with the multiples of 10 on the right hand side of the numbers they are divided by the multiples of 10 so you have you can write 1.5 as 15 tenths isn't it so let's write it down so we have 16 over 15 tenths plus now you have to remember anything to the power of 0 is always equal to 1 so we ha here we have 8 to the power of 0 that's equal to 1 so now let's see this is a fraction let's simplify it further 5 times 3 is 15 5 times 2 is 10 so here you have 16 to the power of 3 over 2 plus 1 so now here what do we have this is the power this is the root so let's write down the root square root of 16 whole to the power of 3 plus 1 so what is square root of 16 that's equal to 4 so you have the power 3 4 cube plus 1 4 cube is 4 times 4 times 4 that's 64 plus 1 which is equal to 65 that's your answer Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye. Take care.